Hi there. In this video, I'm going to create a new field um, for this table here, Buildings 2, and I'm going to populate that field with a random number. <clears throat> so I'm going to show adding the field and then using calculate to calculate, uh, use a field calculator um, within this attribute window to add rand random numbers, firstly using Arcade and then using Python. So you can see uh, two ways of doing it. Uh, so let's get cracking, let's add a field. So I've got the attribute table open here. If it's not open, you would just go right hand mouse click attribute tables. And you can see it's, uh, it's the DC buildings from Microsoft that I've got loaded in the background. Um, click add field in the attributes table. And I'm going to call this um, value, oh, <coughs> value index. There's some kind of um, um, index to, to, to the value of the property rather than a specific um, sort of value. Now I won't bother with an alias. Uh, on, yeah, long is OK. Uh, the rest of it, I'll enforce numeric. But as you can see, I could force percentage and currency and stuff here. Um, have a play. I'll just go for numeric, and you can define how many decimal places and stuff. Let's just do a couple, I think. Actually, no, I'm not going to use any. Uh, press OK. Um, and so you can see there, there's various settings here for the numbers and uh, precision and uh, length of you, you know, with the text string. Um, so, but I'm I'm just. I just want a value from sort of 1 to 500 really uh, to store that. So one, once you've done that, um, you know, you can, it's not in the main buildings yet, but I can just close that. <clears throat> and now you can see value index with all zeros. Let's use the calculator. You can right hand mouse click on the field itself and go to calculate field, or you can hit the calculate button there, but I'll just go this way, it's straightforward, calculate field. Let's just make this um, a little bit bigger so you can see. So the first way I'm going to do this is with Arcade. So the input table is Buildings 2, that's that one. Uh, and the I'm going to update Value Index and I'm going to use Arcade. And what sort of expression I'm going to use? Well, I'm just going to use the inbuilt random. And it's going to be 500 sort of range and that's how you do that. There's lots of other um, functions in here that you can use. Uh, there's random listed. I just typed it in. Um, but you know there's quite a few things to, that you can choose and play around with. But um, it's a random number. That's what I wanted. So if we click apply, um, you'll see it up here. And there they all are. A random number up to 500. How do you do that in Python? Well, slightly different. Let's go to Python. Python 3 support and what you've got to do here is say well what do you want to do it's a random um, uh, integer that actually I'm going to create and it's a range um, 0 to 500 um, and you import the random capability into that code so it knows how to run it so that's what you do with Python that's how you put that in um, I'll click apply again and you'll see this all get updated and there you go it's all been um, reset just to prove that let's set everything to zero so I just set it to zero do apply all zeros and let's put the um, Python back in Them. <clears throat> and there you have it. So that is how you can put in some random values into your data. I hope that helps.